Hi, I'm Dr. Jeffrey Rothstein. I'm a neurologist and a neuroscientist at Johns Hopkins University. For over 25 years, I've been studying amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, or ALS. Today, I'll tell you about some of the exciting new research we are doing here to halt this devastating disease. ALS is a uniformly fatal disease. There are no exceptions. Most people think it's not a very common disease, but in fact, one out of every 500 men that die will die with ALS. That's why it's so very important for us to understand why the disease starts and how we can stop it. So we can use a car to understand what goes wrong in ALS. In ALS, your muscles don't work. Your muscles are like the tires on this car. But in a car, when the tires don't turn, when your muscles don't contract and move your fingers, the problem can be a flat tire. It can be the crankshaft that connects from the engine, or it can be the engine itself. So what's wrong in ALS? It's not the tires. Your muscles don't get ill in ALS. It's a problem in the engine, which is the cells in your brain, and the connection from your engine, the crankshaft, the cells in your spinal cord. And now let's talk about our research. We've come to learn that in ALS, the problem is the core of the cell, the nucleus. Every cell has a nucleus where all the action takes place. And the real action in the nucleus is our DNA. Here I have our DNA. DNA codes for or makes proteins. makes you. So one of the things that we've discovered is that there's a problem with this DNA, the pearls on the string. We've learned that the string in ALS is very long. Lots and lots and lots of extra string. And that's a problem for making you. Normally what happens is that special proteins come in to bring all of these pearls together. In ALS, the string gets in the way. Let me show you how. That long string is very sticky. Let's use duct tape as an example. Normally, that string is short, but when it's very long, proteins stick to it. And they can't do what they're supposed to do. How do we fix that? we've discovered a drug that prevents this sticking. This drug coats that sticky paper, and now those proteins don't stick anymore and can do what they have to do to make you. Right now, this is experimental in the laboratory. Our goal is to turn this into real medicine for our patients and make a real difference in their lives. Music